a bona fide Canadian. Yeah. Wait a minute. You don't look Canadian. Ding. Don't I though? <laughs> Whoa! You're super Canadian. What was I thinking? We are going to make a maple apple pie. Because everyone likes pie. Boop! When you're making a pie, it's important to set your expectations. Do you really want to go ahead and start baking a pie from scratch? I don't think so. And do you really want to take the time for frozen pie crust to thaw before your very eyes? Thought provoking. This is instant French pie crust. It's French. Can you see that? Don't worry, you just can't read it because it's in another language. Crude at tart. Huh. Crude tart? I barely know a tart. Does that work? See, some jokes don't work in international waters. Empty contents of pouch into a bowl. Take it open. Take it open? What? Oh. Uh, 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 uh. Don't throw this away, because this holds the key to your future. Add five to six tablespoons ice cold water one at a time, mash with fork. Uh, only add enough to hold dough together. Do not overmix. Now, I can only assume by add ice cold water, they mean add the coldest setting of the sink. You know, or at least that's what I think they mean. <laughs> one. Two, mash with fork. Three, four. Oh, mm. mixing, mixing is so fun when you have an oven. Would you turn that on, dear? Look at that, we did it. See, guys, our two nations can be friends. Can, a uh, da. Did we make pie crust or like a thick cement paste? Next ingredient is to uh, reaffirm your desire to make this pie. Mm. Mmm! Divide in half and form two flattened balls. What is a flattened ball? Isn't a ball like this? And wouldn't a flattened thing just be like something flat? Riddle me that. I'm gonna speak French with you to show my cultural awareness for your native tongue. D'accord? D'accord. Le sang est sur la branche. Oui. Okay, Canadian friend, let's make two balls. Two balls of equal size. Go ahead. <laughs> I'm watching. Uh -huh -huh. What a perfect ball! Cut your apple into sections and it's a very slice of life cooking moment. Since you're sober, you get to use a real knife. Never forget guys, your fingers are the only ones you've got. So don't do dangerous things with them. That seems about right. La dee dee, dee dee bow. Now you've cut up all your apples. Wow! Take a little bite. Mm. Next, add these three things. Brown sugar. Looks like the bag is pooping. Canadian cinnamon comes in a bag. How much does it need to be? Oh, just as much as how much. Okay. Yay! And then butter. I'm not trying to butter you up or anything, but hold this. She loves it! It's important to use sci-fi sound effects to determine how much butter you use. <laughs> A great way to mix your ingredients is to put them all first into a Ziploc bag and then shake them all together. That way they're all pretty evenly distributed. However, if you did not even think of that until now, here's another way to use a Ziploc bag to mix your ingredients. Da da da! Wow! It's good. Every little tin is gonna be alright. If I was playing poker, I'd be all tin. This dough is sticky and disgusting feeling. Put it across the tin, yet another horrible experience of baking. In the same way that you are filling your mind with cultural awareness, fill this pie tin with apples and butter and cinnamon and sugar. Ding! Ew, you can touch it if you want. I hate touching things like that, but go for it. These really look appetizing, don't you think? Take the sugary afterbirth and spread it around. <laughs> ah! Sorry. <laughs> As a part of unifying our fine countries together, we got American cheddar and cheese curds. Oh my goodness, cheese curds, a classical Canadian dish. What, a, what pray tell, beautiful, smart American are we gonna do with those fine specimens? We're gonna put them in the pie. That's pretty curd rageous of you. In America, you put a slice of cheddar cheese on top of apple pie. Because we're disgusting. Oh, he's so happy to beat his doom. Mmm. Take your beautiful manifestations of strength and put them in the oven to bake. Good luck! Hope you come out better than you once were. Bake for 25 minutes. Da na 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 na. Bing! Ooh! Whoa! This pie is so international! But wait! This pie is mostly filled with apples. How do we Canadian end it up a bit? Let me tell you. Bang! Whoa, Canada, you are so good at pie. Sizzler was so
so gross. Let your pie cool so you don't burn your entire face. Perfect. Pick off a little piece from the top. Woo hoo hoo. Mm. Oh my god. It's like a little symphony inside my mouth. Oh! Whoa. It's delicious? Question mark? Mmm. Mm. Oh fuck. That's delicious. Hey, the lesson is don't waste time filling yourself with doubt. Instead, fill yourself with apple, cinnamon, butter, and nutmeg. Why? Because in pie, we crust. Hey -o. If at first you don't succeed, <laughs> Do they still pie, make pie again. That's right. And pray to God it cooks all the way through. Because, I mean, I really don't want to die from doing this show.